I'm actually slightly concerned how much money I'm going to spend today though. I'm not going to get any sleep because I'm so worried. I sat in this chair for hours. I just think it's so gorgeous. I love quarter to one in the morning. I've got seven bags of charity. You've been on the ages now. You need to come and have a little chill out. That's like £90 off. Smart dressing gown, you know. Hello honeys. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're just showing me now, then hi, my name's Imogen. I am so excited for this video. I literally am going to be living off coffee because today... Honey bees. I want to change up Black Friday content because I feel like I've got lots of hauls coming your way. I wanted to show you the behind the scenes of 24 hours of shopping on Black Friday. But today it is early morning and I'm gonna be shopping for homeware. I'm gonna be shopping for clothes. I'm gonna be shopping for gadgets. I'm gonna be shopping for everything, make up the lot. So make sure you hit that subscribe button and join my family of Huns because buckle up and get ready for 24 hours of Black Friday shopping. And there is a massive try on haul, fingers crossed that everything arrives because I'm gonna order it pronto. But there will be a massive try on haul at the end of this video as well. I then will be having a Topshop, Zara, H&M and ASOS haul coming soon. I am then having a massive homeware haul coming soon as well. And a really big gift guide. I've got four videos this week, so make sure you turn the bell notification to be notified for my videos. So exciting. This is the setup for today. I've got my desk, I've got my, my dirty MacBook Pro. So let's do it. I do know that the fast fashion brands like Misguided, Pretty Little Thing, Boohoo, Nasty Gal, they all have their early Black Friday discounts. So I'm gonna get in with those first off. I wanna get all the coats. That is what I want. First thing I do when I online shop is go to new in because I feel like unless I have something in my mind that I'm like, I need that, I'd rather just go to new in to see, look, 35% off everything, tree to clock, 35% off. Oh my God, that hoodie is gorgeous. I want to go on Etsy because I know they have bits as well. This is going to be a long, long day. So I'm actually apologizing about the fact I'm seeing everything that I love. I like to get big items on Black Friday because I feel like you're saving the most on the biggest items. Now don't get me wrong, I love buying like loads of little tops, but I would rather get like a big selection of coats. Also, I just really quickly wanted to let you know that I am giving away to charity two times of everything that I'm buying. So if I'm buying a jumper, I'm giving away two jumpers in my closet. Closet? Is that the thing you say? So I just want you to know that I'm going to be donating bags and bags to charity because I feel like it's about giving back. I don't want to keep buying things if I've got no space for it. So I feel like that's a really nice thing as well to do while you're shopping, like clearing it all out, clearing your mind, clearing your cupboards, you know. I want some winter boots. I know that Public Desire actually has have really good discounts as well. Zara Home. <gasps> Give me it all. I want Zara Home. I want H&M Home. I want May. 70% off the boots I want. Where are they? Oh my God, get all your winter boots for Black Friday. This is it. I'm actually slightly concerned how much money I'm gonna to spend today though. Like that is a worry. I wanna get duvets, pillows. I wanna get new homeware bits. Oh my God, I'm gonna get myself a new duvet. Okay, angels, I'm not gonna to lie to you. I find online shopping so hard. I know that sounds so stupid, but I feel like there's so much. I'm on product 1,008 of 20,482 styles. I think 24 hours shopping online is very easy to do because I genuinely think it's a struggle. Oh, and also Pretty Little Thing have got their own homeware stuff, haven't they? Do you know what I really want to find today? A Hoover. Oh my God. I really want one of those belted, oversized, like faux fur coats. Oh, that is what I want. Oh my God, I think I found one. Look at that coat of dreams. Don't look at my dirty laptop. It's actually got covers on it. So it's not that dirty, but. <gasps> belted, it's belted. My angels, I had to come on here to show you this jacket. Like, sorry. I've literally opened so many tabs up here for Topshop. I've opened tabs for H&M. I now need to go on to Zara. And then I saw this. I thought this was so nice. It's one line a day for five years, I think. A five year memory book. I think that is so beautiful. Excuse the fact I've got into a red dress. I was actually trying to sort through things while online shopping. I was like trying things on to see if I would give it away to charity. So I've got a couple of bags coming through already, which is really exciting. But I just thought to myself, <laughs> I looked at the time, I've been shopping for like hours. <gasps> How have I sat in this chair for hours? My actual bum is numb from shopping and sitting on this 
just, I need to get out. But what I was going to say to you is, I really want a pair of Doc Martens. I really want to invest in them. So I'm waiting for ASOS to have a sale. Um, but that'll be later on in the week when I buy all the ASOS bits. But I'm very excited because I'd like to get a pair of Doc Martens, a pair of um, New Balance trainers. I think they're so nice. I think they just look so fresh. Spencer's been in and out of the shower. He's been having his lunch. I'm like, no one stops. I just need coffee and I'm gonna keep going. Come on the 24 hours. Vlogging on my phone. So we are currently in the car on the way to Asda. I've been shopping since 9 a.m. and it is 1.54. Currently downloading Nasty Gal on Spencer's phone because I need to use my phone to film. But Let's get a bit of your attention. Sorry. <laughs> You're not having any of my attention for 24 hours, Spencer. I'm sorry. No, you keep shopping. Yeah, you keep shopping till you drop in. Sorry, just quickly stop in your tracks. They have 60% off 60 percent off on nasty gal they've got oversized shirts jackets oh they've got really cute sweater vests i really want to get some sweater vests you know which ones i mean like that really cute ones i feel like they're so nice just casually shopping on the hubby's phone you know maybe we can do it on your bank card too <laughs> white boots aren't they if you could see them how nice are they 85 reduced to 34 pounds can i get a whoop I put that on my story, right? So I said, is there any Hoover better than Dyson? And everyone kept saying, shock. Spence, you're gonna have to come here because you're gonna get really excited by this. Yeah. And everyone's going, get a shark. So I look up shark. They've got such amazing reviews uh -huh. and everyone's saying they're better. And then I go on John Lewis and it's discounted from 350 pounds to 196. So we've got this coming tomorrow. No, we haven't. Yeah, we, we can collect it from Waitrose. Seriously? Yeah, look. Look, I show you angels. Oh my goodness, so exciting. Nice. Baby, you just wait. I've just been telling mum about it on the phone. Really? Look at it, look at it. Yeah, yeah, look. Look how many different parts of it. There's this part. Oh, no. Wait, there's this part. Yeah. And there's an anti-pet thing. Look, look, there's yeah. so many different parts. When we get a dog. I'm so excited! Oh, yeah, it's yeah. excellent. See, Black Friday shopping's good, baby. Black angels, I'm not gonna lie, I'm sat in my coat because I'm so cold, but I'm drinking cold coffee. Look at my foam. Foam from dairy-free milk and a creamer, dairy-free creamer. Oh, unbelievable. I'm eating on the go, but I just need coffees to keep me awake, to keep going, because I envisage that I'm going to be up all night ordering things. I'm not going to lie to you, my eyes are starting to hurt, because staring at this screen for so long is like, I'm a bit concerned about my life, but it's absolutely fine. This is the 24 hour challenge, we've got to get through it, get through it. Evening time, I am so tired. I actually had to tell myself to eat food earlier, because I was just shopping. Like, I don't know about you, but I just get lost. I thought I would go on La Redoute now for a lovely little homeware. A lot of people have said how nice it is. I think it's French style. I really wanted one of their rugs. I've seen a lot of people buy some of their rugs. It's that one, I think. Yeah, look. Here we go. Yes, it is that one. Look how nice it looks. But I don't know which size to get. It's minus 30% off. Thank you very much. I bet it goes up in price. What? Oh, look, 209. But still, that's like 90 pounds off to land up here because I love their homeware stuff. I've already put stuff in the bag. Oh my God. But that was all Christmas stuff. You might not think it's very nice, but I think that's really cute. So this one isn't discounted, but I'm just gonna think I'm gonna go ahead with it. And then this one's really, really nice. I think that would look nice. Side table or something like that. And then this one, the rattan one, I think that's gorgeous, don't you? Yeah, look, it looks so beautiful. I love the brown, but I'm thinking of getting it in, not taupe. I quite like that color. It's not white, it's not cream, it's this gorgeous, I'm obsessed. So how much is that, 30% off? Get a king, because you want it bigger. 84 pounds. I was also gonna go on the white company and stuff, but I was like, oh, it's so expensive, and I know it is discounted, but I just don't know if I can justify it. I might go on dust. Luxury bedding at affordable prices. Autumn sale up to 50% off. Thank you very much. Me and Spencer have literally had our pillows from Primark for like years. And pillows from Primark are good, but oh my goodness, we've had them for years where they've got like bobbly. I'm so excited to do all the homeware hauls. Oh my God, it's actually discounted. It was 50, now it's 35. Oh my God, they've got discounts. Supreme, this is the best seller. I love it when they say best seller. See, that's discounted, 70 to 49. To get, I want to get the king size and then I want to get the all seasons one. 270 pounds, they've basically got 100 pounds off. I mean, I'm literally going to be on this website. I'll check in with you in a bit. Bit, but I'm gonna be so tired. I know I'm just gonna be shopping on oh, Maid. Maid have got um discounts as well. Oh my god. Yes, H&M Home up to 50% off. Oh my goodness. 
like look at all the discounts the discounts can you even cope oh my goodness homeware 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 i should be wearing my blue light glasses because my eyes are going to be like that did your mum ever tell you when you were younger that your eyes would be like squares if you look at the screen yeah, so much. Yeah, you get too close to your TV and yeah. stuff, yeah. yeah. You've been on the ages now, you need to come and have a little chill out. I know, he keeps telling me to stop. Come on. I've got stuff to get. Plenty of shopping done today. I know. I'm doing a 24 hour challenge pup, I've got to keep going with it. Yeah, well, you are good. You'll be asleep, I'll be chilling next to you. I really wanted a teddy chair. Is there one? Oh my god, made is so nice. Made is honestly such nice bits. They're expensive though. I'm just going to do it until until i've cleared the bank balance yeah right <laughs> got empty a few baskets <laughs> yes we're giving lots of charity so it makes me feel much better i'm not gonna lie i'm tired i'm watching you watch a series is my i'm like put the series on i'll watch it with you but i can't look away from the screen that much because oh look at that that's quite cool oh no you just started me on ebay ebay i've got loads of black friday discounts okay. on brands and stuff oh i'm going on ebay now come on and put it down okay <laughs> putting it down but not putting the laptop down yeah. i love you Baby, he's asleep. 12.47, quarter to one in the morning. Lovely. Been shopping since the early morning of today. That's absolutely excellent. You might be wondering why I'm not talking that quietly. It's because obviously Spencer takes his hearing aid out when he sleeps. So you will not actually hear me now. I'm on my last bits now. I've ordered some bits from Amazon. I've ordered some bits from Etsy as well, home stuff. We're currently on Zara Home. We have some beautiful plates. I mean, they're lovely, aren't they? Some things on Zara Home are quite affordable, and then some things just aren't. Dunelm, I was looking for things, because Dunelm are doing click and collect. I think the click and collect is next day delivery, so I'm definitely going to get some bits from Dunelm. I don't even want to know how much money I've spent. You know when you're like, yeah, let's not talk about it. But it's fine, because we're saving for throughout the year. I don't need anything else now. I've got family presents, presents for Spencer, presents for my siblings, presents for my friends... I've got presents for myself, I've got bits we need around the house, I've got clothes. That's a cool present. Make your own barbecue rub set. You know a couple of people that would really love that. That is definitely going in to my basket. I'm just going to do a bit more shopping. I have literally been staring at this computer. Don't do this at home by the way. Probably going to leave this now and then just do a bit more shopping and then hopefully everything comes in the morning. A Robin breakfast set. Oh my god, it's so cute. I'm probably not going to get any sleep anyway because I'm going to be on this for a while but I'm not going to get any sleep because I'm so worried nothing is going to turn up tomorrow and then I've got nothing to show you guys. I'm stressing. But if it says next day delivery, it means next day delivery, doesn't it? This is how my head works. I'll be worrying about the fact it won't come all night. Just ignore me. Oh my goodness, look at all this. Here we go then, Huns. Some of it's arriving. Some of it still needs to come. All of the homeware stuff, etc. that I've ordered, but we have got some bits in here. We've got Boohoo, Misguided, Pretty Little Thing, Nasty Gal. We've got Zara, we've got Topshop. I cannot wait to show you this stuff on. 24 hours of shopping sitting right in front of you and there's even more to come. The biggest H&M box I've ever ordered in my whole life. Oh my goodness and one of the asos packages have come but not all of them yet i'm still waiting for so much homeware but oh my lord oh so beautiful angels we're going to do a try on section of all the bits that i've got from black friday so so buzzing we're this is the first piece that i got i'm absolutely in love with this this is like a sweater but it's like a charcoal sweater it says plt sport there and obviously i had to get the matching joggers because you know about the matching joggers vibe like sorry sorry what i love them because i feel like they're oversized but fitted in the same way these are a medium this was in a size small just because i feel like they are oversized anyway you get so many different colors of these tracksuits and pretty little thing and that's what i like about them that you can just really really style them up but obviously with black friday they're so much cheaper so why not get them what i love about two pieces is i can wear this jumper with jeans i can wear this jumper with anything but I was also wear these jog but I could also wear these joggers with like a jumper something like that you know I just think it's a really nice cute vibe you know cozy two pieces make you look put together but I literally just put on a two piece I've done nothing special today except wear a tracksuit you know by the way all the links for everything I've purchased from my 24 hours of shopping for Black Friday will be in the description and then obviously there's a lot of hauls to come because if I was to make this all into one video it would be boring no sorry I could not be more obsessed with a coat if I tried I need did an oversized Borg jacket. I haven't got a black long line puffer jacket. I know you might say, what? Because you've got too many coats, Majin. But I am getting rid of those for charity, but I have not got a coat like this. Look, it's even got a big, oh my God, oh my God. I am absolutely 
absolutely sick. It could be with joggers like I'm wearing it now with some black boots, but you can also wear it with anything. You can wear it with trainers, you can do whatever you want with it. I really like the detailing that it's got because it's not just a puffer jacket, it's not a padded long line jacket. It's also got this wonderful Borg detailing. So it just takes it up and changes it completely. And I think that is such a vibe. It it's like lightweight and warm, but not too much, if you know what I mean. I don't think I could be more obsessed with this sweater vest top. I'm absolutely in love with it. This is the dog tooth print vibe. Is it dog tooth or hound's tooth? I don't actually know. I've got a long line white shirt with it. I got this one from Zara. I just think it's so gorgeous. I love the detailing here. Just looks like really old school, doesn't it? Like old school cricket vibes. I just think it's absolutely stunning. And again, you could wear this with some faux leather trousers. That would look so nice. Like faux leather, gorgeous, shiny trousers would look so gorgeous. Jeans, nice trousers. You could wear this with not a shirt underneath. You could wear it with a nice long sleeve top underneath. A roll neck would look so nice. I just think it's really, really gorgeous. And I got this in a size eight. Everything I've purchased is in a size eight, a small. And if it's a medium, I will tell you, I won't get it wrong. But what do we think about this? Love it. Then I got another pair of joggers because genuinely I think pretty little thing joggers are actually the best. Sorry, is this making me look like I've got like a nice hip shape? Because I don't, it's an illusion. I got these in a size small. I feel like Spence will be nabbing these though because they're quite oversized. So they're a nice fit. I really tighten them here with the drawstring, but they are absolutely gorgeous. I've not seen any jogger in this color. Like I've seen a navy blue, I've seen like a light blue. I've never seen like an acidy wash blue. Like with an oversized leather jacket, it would look so nice. I feel like these can just change up so easily. You can wear joggers really smart with some boots tucked in. I just think that's a vibe. But you wear them with trainers, wear them with an oversized hoodie. No one wants to see your string, honeybee, but yeah, love the fit, love the bit at the bottom. Okay, so this takes the shacket to a whole other level. This is a shacket coat. This is a long line Borg shacket. It's got buttons all the way down. This isn't like a Borg coat, it's not as thick. So it's definitely gonna be thinner whether you wanna wear it with joggers, whether you wanna wear it with jeans, you know, whether you wanna layer up underneath it, but this is not a Borg coat because it's a little bit thinner on the inside. I'm absolutely obsessed. Oh, it's one size. Well, that's good if it fits everyone. I do think they do a petite one and they do do a plus one as well. I just love how cozy it is. I love how easy it is to just put it on and look really good. I feel like it's so autumn, Christmas, winter time because I feel like of the color and I love anything Borg. I just think it's so nice. The material is so soft and I feel like you could really make this outfit work with so many different ways. Like honestly, this with an all black outfit, knee high black boots, just so cute. Just absolutely love it. Sorry, but this is a two piece of dreams. I got this two piece because I absolutely love the color. I think the color is stunning. It's this olivey, wonderfully soft, but oh, it's not too vibrant. It's just really like nude olive, if you know what I mean. It's like subtle, but not too subtle. I love their two pieces from Pretty Little Thing because I just feel like they fit so nicely. I actually got the top in a size eight and I got the bottoms in a size 10 because I really wanted them to fit on my hips. And I think they just look really nice because they look even longer. And they look kind of flary, but they're not flare at the bottom. You can wear them completely individually or completely together. And I think that's what makes them work. I just think this outfit with a nice corset as well would look so hot. But then also you could wear it with a nice hoodie. And then wear some really cool trainers, like some Air Forces or some chunky trainers from wherever. And it would just look so nice. But like I think this is just like a cool, slouchy vibe. Like, I'm going to the office, but I'm not going to the office. But I look cute enough to go to the office, but I still look casual. You know? Okay, so now we're starting with guided bits. I am absolutely in love with this dress. I think it's so gorgeous. Honestly, when I saw it on the model, I did not think it would look nice on me. The way it fits on the body is so nice. It's corseted here. I got it in a size six, I think. I think I got it in a size six, yeah. Such a nice, gorgeous material. It's got this corset detail here, so if I wanted to, you know, when we're going out, when we're allowed out one day, push them up with some uh, pads and love my life. I love the back of it. I feel like this is very much House of CB, but so much more affordable. I love the way it shapes you here. I just think that's so nice, and I love the frill detail here. Oh, just whacked myself in the face. Excellent. This top, what do you guys think? I'm wearing it with some trousers I bought from Zara the other week, a while ago. But this is like a sweetheart neck top. I need to hide my nude bra because that is not the one, is it? I'm such a granny. I love nude underwear. I love like the big granny pants. I remember when my mum actually gave birth to Freya, she used to buy all these old big like knickers. And I'm telling you this now, like she had an unopened pack and I was like, I need to wear them. They were so comfy. Then I came all the way up here and I was just in my element. So I obviously have sexy underwear as well, but yeah. Gorgeous floaty sleeves. I actually got this in another color because I think it's so nice from Miss Guided. Got this in a size eight. I love the fit of it. I love the fact it's ribbed. It's very different because it goes up at the side and down at the back. 
like I feel like you can wear it with jeans, you can wear it with black trousers, wear it with whatever you want. I feel like it just works. It's a plain top, but it's not plain because it's got like the rib, it's got the sleeves, it's got the neckline. It's a very sexy neckline, I think. What do you think? Step aside because I think I found my new favourite coat and I know I say that all the time, but my one obsession is coats. Like genuinely, I know I have so many coats to give out to charity, but I just get more and more obsessed with coats. It's just my thing. It's like a big puffer black jacket, but with a belt. It's making a little bit of noise because I've just bought it. We've just got it. So it's one of those ones that wants to talk. It's like a ski jacket, but fashionable. Although ski wear is so fashionable. It gives you a snatched waist. It is such amazing, gorgeous feel. I love it so much. It literally makes you feel so warm as well because it's all the way up to the neck and it's padded everywhere. Like it's proper padded. I just love the fact the popper details are all black as well. I think it's so smart and chic but also really warm and just really cosy. It's really giving me an extra pad. I love it so much. I got this in a size 8 but just absolutely gorgeous isn't it this dress? 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 Think it's a coat. So this is actually the hoodie that I thought would look so nice with those blue joggers from Pretty Little Thing. It is a tennis gorgeous hoodie. I love the blue detailing. I love hoodies. I feel like I want plain ones. I want ones with graphics on the outside. I love oversized hoodies. I got this in a size 8, but it's a naturally oversized hoodie anyway. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. I really like the way you can just like roll it up, roll it down. Hoodies go with everything. Hoodies would look so nice with all the jackets I got. This outfit with that Borg coat from earlier, the Borg jacket, so gorgeous. Absolutely love it. I just think it's such a nice way of changing up a complete white hoodie and making it a bit different with a little slogan there. Then I got these trousers which I am in love with. I feel like these are very much in. I got them from Zara but they didn't fit me very nicely so I returned the ones that were a bit baggy on me. These are still a nice fit. They're not really really tight and they're not really really loose. Like I'm just gonna wear them with trainers. I can wear them with boots tucked in. I think they're just such a nice vibe. You can wear it with a nice shirt. Wear it with that sweater vest from earlier. Wear it with a nice bodysuit or wear it with a hoodie. And especially for a night out, like you can really make these work with like pointed heeled boots with a nice black turtleneck and oversized leather jacket. Like that's really smart chic for me. I just really like these. But as you can see, I was not messing when I said I got it in two different colors. I actually wanted it in the camel color as well. The phone there is like my little mirror. Yeah, I know, budget, budget here. But this is absolutely gorgeous. I love it in the white. Again, you've got the lovely sleeves. You've got the rib detailing. It's not a bright white. It's like an off-white. Sweetheart neckline, absolutely gorgeous. And then I teamed it with these trousers. These trousers, I think, are absolutely stunning. These are pinstriped long leg trousers. And they are quite long on me. However, oh, bring me back. However, they're not too long, but when I wear them with boot heels, they would really, really drape along the floor still. Yeah, I don't even need to get these taken up. These are like the perfect length for me. With trainers, this outfit would look so nice. With boots, with boot heels. Oh, the sun is coming in. I love it. Give me all the sun. It's absolutely freezing outside, so I will just stay inside and get the sun. But I absolutely love these two pieces. I just think they're so nice. The trousers, I got in a size six. And the top, I got in a size eight. So, I really wanted one of these dresses. I felt like I saw them everywhere on, like, Pinterest. And everyone just wearing them with, like, knee-high boots or tights. I just wanted a plain, black, gorgeous dress that had this really nice neckline. It's like a shirt neckline, but it's not. It's thin, but it's also ribbed. It's a really nice material that doesn't cling to you and make you feel like you can see every lump and bump. But I feel like this is just a really nice dress. I'm going to layer it up with a nice big oversized cardigan, a nice big oversized coat and some boots and some tights. I just feel like it really is so nice. I love the material. I love the way it looks. I got this in a size 8 as well. I feel like it's really nice fitting on my body. I feel like black is such a good colour. It goes with everything. And I feel like it's just going to work with all the coats I've got. But I also got this. I... I think this is my favourite faux leather jacket I've ever had. But what I love about it is the detail. It looks so expensive because of the puff sleeves. So look, can you see the puff sleeves just add this like, I'm expensive but I'm not expensive. Got this in a size 8 and I really wanted it in the brown colour but I think it's sold out. But I think it's just so nice the way it fits. It really does snatch you in. looks nice with this dress but it'll look really nice with some trousers, some high-waisted jeans, high-waisted faux leather trousers as well would look so cute, but I just think it's so nice done up, but also undone as well. Then I know, shock horror, I got another white hoodie, but hear me out, I feel like this is a little bit different because it's got a different slogan here, but it's a very different style hoodie. 
because it's not got the drawstring. It's oversized more than the other one. So this one's in a medium. So can you see it's a lot more oversized? So I feel like this is just a really nice fitting hoodie. I love the way it's oversized. Spencer can wear this one. You share with the boyfriend, share with the husband. You've got to do it, Hans. Share with your girlfriend, your mum, your sister, your dad, your brother, whatever you want to do. Share with whoever. Or don't share at all. I just find that I'm always cold. Like when I go out, even with a coat on, I need more layers underneath. Is anyone else like that? I got these trousers, which I have been eyeing up for so long. I hope you can see them. They are gorgeous. They are faux leather trousers, high waisted, but also with a leg slit. I thought they were gonna look really cheap and really tight, and I was like, oh no, they're gonna look horrible on my legs. These are a size eight, and I just think they look so nice. Like, I think the high waistedness of them is like a good high waistedness, you know? If that's even a word, it's not a word. Crop your hoodie up, wear it like this. Wear an oversized jacket, that would look so nice. Wear this with trainers, wear it with some nice pointed heeled boots. I just think these trousers are a must. Then earlier I got a long line padded jacket, but I don't actually have a black puffer jacket, which is short. I got this in a size eight, but their puffer jackets are so affordable and so good. I actually just got rid of some actually. I gave some to charity and put some on Depop, but I just love it. It's got a hood, it's like oversized, so it like sits nicely at the back. I love the fact it's got a hood. I find that so many puffer jackets just don't have hoods and I'm like, I need the hood because it rains. I like the silver detailing as well and I like the fact you can draw it in. I think it looks so nice with this outfit as well. I just think that is actually a vibe. Then I feel like this is the ultimate in ultimate coats. It's not just a ball coat. It's not a dressing gown by the way, but it looks like it. It just looks like a very, oh my God. I actually saw a girl wearing this ages ago and I thought, where is that from? And then I went on the website during the Black Friday. I thought, I found it. This is absolutely gorgeous. Do you know why? It's so thick and soft, but it just doesn't look like a dressing gown. It looks like a smart dressing gown, you know? <gasps> Open or closed, it's so nice. Without the bathrobe bit or whatever, without this bit or not. And I haven't seen one with a tie around. I see so many with buttons, but I'm not the most biggest fan of buttons because I sometimes don't feel like they give you much of a waist. They don't make you fitted. Sometimes, so sometimes you just want the option to be like, I'm just getting out of bed, but I'm not, you know? This colour hoodie is a bit of me. When I saw it on the website and I saw different colours in it, I was like, oh, I need this colour. I love the drawstring, if I can find the other one, there you go. I just think it's such a nice colour. I love the seam detailing. I think it's such an olivey, green, wonderful colour. Wear it with black jeans, wear it with black high-waisted trousers, wear it with some joggers, like some nice creamy joggers it would look so nice with. I absolutely love this. I love the way it just fits. I love the fact that these are a bit lighter. I got it in a size 10. So I got it a little bit oversized, but I just think it's so, so nice. I really, really like it. What do you think? We are making our way through this. This 24 hour challenge, let me tell you, I am tired. Like I've been shopping, now I'm trying on all the shopping. I'm grateful, I'm so buzzing, but I'm tired after this challenge. I'm telling you, this challenge has absolutely knackered me out, but I'm gonna do this 24 hours. You just watch. Right, I got this last by New Easy's from Boohoo. I absolutely love it. I didn't know if I ordered the right color. I felt like I ordered black, but I'm actually so glad I ordered this color because it's such a nice baby blue jacket. I really like it because again, it's got this wonderful stretch here. It's quite like a bomber jacket. It's like a bomber faux leather jacket. I think I've done it wrong, but it's absolutely fine. It looks cute, you know? It looks very chic. It looks very cos. It looks very Zara. It looks very open. I actually love it. I think it's so nice. You can get it in black. You can get it in cream. You can get it in brown. I just think it's a really nice faux leather jacket. Short, cropped, and cute. So now we are on to nasty gal bits. This jacket, this is a shacket again. I saw these colours and I was like, could I make it work? And then I realised I am an independent boss baby girl. Whatever I want to wear, I will wear. If I like it, I'm going to make it work. I really like the fit of this. It's not really oversized. It's quite boxy, which I think is really like chic. Do you know? Yeah, I absolutely love this shacket done up. I've got a roll neck on underneath, but you can wear it with a nice white top underneath. You can wear it open. You can wear it done up with nothing else underneath as well. And that would look cute as well. But I think it's really nice. So I got that shacket in a size medium and I got this in a size eight. So this is a gorgeous roll neck. Honestly, this is like the perfect height for me. I would say this is a cropped jumper, but it's not super cropped where it's like up here. And you can see like the bottom of your bra. This is just like a nice cropped jumper. I love the fact that it's got the sleeves as well. That's what I found made it really different to a normal, just a roll neck. It's got these wonderful sleeves that really, really elongate your arms, but also make them look slimming because they come in at the cuff. Really like this jumper. I think it's so nice with high-waisted trousers, high-waisted jeans, however you want to wear everything, but with a nice oversized thick coat or a shacket. You can have it in so many different colours as well. It's really affordable, especially with a Black Friday. Then I know I should have ironed my shirt. Let's just not... Wow, that sun is bright and that is amazing. I love it. Did you see that? 
wow i got this sweater vest which i think is absolutely gorgeous i got, I got this in a size small medium i just think it's such a nice color again it's got this wonderful detailing here i love these vests i think you can wear them with anything you can wear them with just a t-shirt underneath you can wear them with a roll neck underneath and yeah obviously we're gonna get black friday deals we're gonna get the vest in a cream nude color but again I haven't got any black ones actually, I've just got the monochrome one, but black and grey would be a nice colour as well, wouldn't it? Right, so I really wanted a pair of acid wash jeans, but I found that some of them just didn't look right. These ones from Nasty Gal, I got them in a size blue. No, I got them in a size 6, and I'm absolutely in love with them. Oh, I can rip the tag off, can't I? Okay, let's use scissors next time, Imogen, let's learn. But I just love these acid wash jeans. I like the fact they're straight on the bottom of the leg. They're not like a mum jean, they're a bit baggy, they're really nicely high-waisted. I really like the fact that they're like a light, but not a really light acid blue wash. You know when they have those like really white ones, which I feel like I can't pass off. These ones are just a super, super nice colour. And then I also teamed it with another vest. Woo, woo, woo. This is different though. Hear me out. This is like a t-shirt vest, isn't it? Because can you see it's got longer sleeves? It's not like that. I wouldn't even say this is a vest, but I got this in a size small, medium. I think it's such a nice outfit. I just teamed it with a white plain top on underneath. But I just think it's really, really, really nice. Again, it's like got this like, drop hem here which is just super cool and casual. You could tuck it in if you wanted. You could wear a black jeans, but I think this whole acid wash look looks really nice. So yeah. Right, so I got these trousers. I got them in a size six. These are my favorite trousers of the whole haul. They fit so nicely, but not just that. They are such a thick material. These feel like Zara. These feel like even more expensive than Zara. What's that one that they own, Massimo Duty? These feel so expensive. I love the black button. I love the fact that I haven't done the zip up all the way. They are just like the perfect length. And I just feel like these trousers are so in at the moment. I honestly am obsessed with them. You've got a part to put the belt in. I can't explain to you. I've got to take a seat and show you like the bottom of them. Look how nice they are. I'm absolutely in love. Like I can't even cope. Everything's leaked down below, but I'm so sorry that took so long, didn't it? Oh, I'm sorry. Angels, this is how the bags are looking for charity so far. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I've got seven bags of charity. I still need to clear out all my coats and jumpers. So I've just got some light bits, dresses and stuff like that. But this is a lot of stuff and I need to fill this bag over here as well, this big Primark bag. So we're working our way through. I need to get rid of some shoes as well. But before I ever buy anything I always make sure that I'm giving to charity giving to my loved ones and making sure that homeless shelters and everything else I have space in my wardrobe but also I'm giving back to other people so yeah I never do hauls and know that I'm putting clothes on top of clothes I have to make sure I've got space and also otherwise I'm buying things myself when I have plenty and I'm very grateful so yeah I'm giving this all to charity and there's a couple more bags to be filled. So really exciting stuff. Makes me feel amazing. We love giving to charity. It's amazing. I've got my sweet boy here now to help me dismantle everything. Hello, um, buddy. We need to sort through even more to give to charity. So yeah, we've got to make space before we actually allow Beautiful. space. We've got seven bags already for charity. But that is the end of my 24 hours shopping. You were in the last one, actually. Yes. Yes, you were. So that was 24 hours. In a similar hours. outfit, actually. Yeah, you were. Oh, God, he's been on a bike ride this morning. Thank you so much for watching my 24 hours shopping. I managed to do the 24 hours. It was a long day of shopping Legend. yesterday. And it's a long day of trying everything on today. But I really hope you like it. Definitely let me know which bits you like the most. Everything we linked in the description if you want to go and shop and cop the outfits. Plus, I have a huge Zara Topshop H&M haul. She does. Then I have a huge homeware haul from all of the 24 hours of shopping. Because I spent quite a lot of money money that means that we're going to have more hauls so i've got four videos this week so make sure you have that notification Shut bell turned on front door oh my god he's really getting into it look all the ad libs make sure you have that bell notification turned on so you get all of the notifications for when i upload and i love you guys so much until next time i'm gonna love you and i'm gonna leave you bye everyone be safe i love you bye bye